What's up guys, this is Fam coming at you with another awesome video today. In today's video I will be doing a Blu-ray collection over all my all Blu-rays that I've been collecting. Some of you are going to see that I reviewed already on the unboxing videos that I do. Some of you are going to be very recognizable, some that you already are familiar with, but you know. Um, you know, I'm not a big, you know, Blu-ray collection, like I don't have a big uh, following of a... Uh, a blue a blu-rays yet oh you know, I'm still kind of a you know still kind of new at the you know movies and collecting movies and all sorts uh, I don't have like a lot of them yet you know I'm barely growing so hopefully I get to that point where I grow so many of them but you know this is a good way to start the video you know I will be doing updates you know each time that I keep growing on my blu-rays and because I do got a lot of DVDs but you know I just want to do a Blu-ray, uh, all Blu-rays, and you know, and I, I, you know, some movies that I want that are still in DVD, but you know, I hope they get in Blu-ray soon. So yeah, let's start this Blu-ray collection and all the movies that I collect. So yeah, okay, start with number one, and that's Aquaman on Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. So this one comes with the Blu-ray and it also comes with the DVD. Also, I reviewed this one. If you want to check that out, please check that out. The next one is a still book cover. And that is Predator and Blu-ray DVD. Look at that nice still book. Very beautiful. Awesome artwork. And yeah, guys. And the next one we have is um, Freddy vs. Jason on Blu-ray. This is just a regular Blu-ray. Awesome movie. Uh, good kills. Um, awesome battle between those two horror icons. Next one we have is... Friday the 13th, the final chapter. One of the best uh, Friday the 13th films. Uh, probably my favorite one. Awesome uh, Jason. Very, very vicious. Um, I'm, I'm not going to say it's my favorite one because I still like the remake. But yeah, um, this is a good one. And I, rem I recommend checking this out. You know, it's very good film. The next one we have is uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The Secret of the Ooze, Part 2. This one I just got because it has a lot of nostalgia to it. This is one I grew up watching when I was a kid. And yeah, I'm just a big uh, Ninja Turtles fan. And the next one I have is a very good film, Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Which, you know, this one has a lot of memories. So it brings a lot of memories back to this film. And yeah, guys, uh, I, do, I recommend checking it out. The next one I have is The Hulk. The uh, played by Eric Bana, the very first Hulk film of um, you know before post uh, Edward Norton and uh, Mark Ruffalo. This was, there was Edward uh, Eric Bana, so yeah, and um, yeah, he did a hell of a job. One of my favorite Hulk films, very underrated in my opinion. So I recommend checking it out. It's a great film. Speaking of Friday the 13th, Friday the 13th remake on Blu-ray, Killer Cut Edition. This is one of the best, uh, I remember when I was st first I started collecting them, this was the very first uh, movies that I collected. So, yeah, and I thought the, the all the shots, all, you can tell that it was very nice. You can tell that it was in Blu-ray and I just really, I think one of the very first ones that I fell in love with Blu-ray and what it, uh, Inspired me to get in Blu-ray one of the movies, but I'll tell you which one that did though Next one I got is American Werewolf from London great film Love the movie cool action just a overall good movie. I recommend if you haven't watched it recommend you watch it Next one we have is American Psycho with uh, the 1960s film. I think this one came in 1960 It was a Norman Bates, you know about a psycho, you know that has a you know, uh, lots of issues, <laughs> and, uh, you know, just very, not honest, you know, not right in his head, you know, but it's a very great film, you know, um, I, I know people that don't like old movies, and think it's so, it's not good, but, you know, the guy that plays, uh, Norman Bates, Anthony Perkins, is a very great psycho, and if you're a horror fan, a true horror fan, I recommend you checking this out, it's a great film, and this is the one that I won. That very first film that I got on Blu-ray, I think, was the uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, 
in 3D. I remember when I watched this, it had a great call, uh, great um, shots. You can tell it was in Blu-ray. Some of the shots, you didn't even need the 3D glasses. It just looked real to me, especially when it had the 3D. It had a good opening. Uh, it's just a... Uh, this is a film that wanted me to collect Blu-rays, and you know I thank Chase Chainsaw Massacre for that. Next one I got is Terminator Salvation. This is the this is the movie without Arnold Schwarzenegger. It was the very first film without him. Great film has Christian Bell in it. Badass actor, loves him. my favorite Batman. And yeah, guys, he's just a badass overall. And uh, yeah, I got this on Blu-ray, director's cut. And I recommend that you watch this and, you know, some people don't like it, but I do, you know. If you like a lot of action, if you like a lot of Mad Max kind of feel, you know, all Earth destroyed and everything, I recommend checking this out. And the last but not least is Suicide Squad. Uh, extended cut. Love Suicide Squad. Loved uh, Deadshot as, uh, you know, Will Smith as Deadshot. Uh, sad that he's not going to reprise the role. You know, but, you know, overall, it's a good movie. Jared Leto did it good for what he had, had to work with. And overall, the whole cast did good. Um, Yeah, love this movie. But, yeah, guys, that's all for my, that's all I have for Blu-rays. Um, keep an eye out for other videos. I will be doing more updates when I keep growing my Blu-rays. And, yeah, guys, if you like this, if you're new to my channel, please like, comment. I'd like to know your thoughts on my Blu-rays. And please subscribe, guys, if you're new to the channel. I'd like to you know, get people that love uh, movies like I do. And yeah, guys, thanks again for watching. And I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.